Well, not just the last two nights, basically the last, skip the last 25 games. Um, I think they're going to miss the playoffs. There's no reason for optimism. Now I just turn into the game to see how many points LeBron's going to score. Um, they don't play any defense. They turn the ball over. Uh, guys are getting uh, shoot-around threes. I'm talking about wide open. Guys are going off the dribble. And I get that small lineup, Skip, but they got crushed on the glass. They got beat by 21. And when you play a small lineup, you can't worry about leaking out. You can't worry about getting fast break points. You got to have everybody coming to try to get on the glass. They got out rebounded 64 to 43. 64-43, Skip. Come on. You're not, you're not beating anybody giving up that kind of... And, and guys shoot 9-17, 9-17. I mean, and so even though... Uh, when you look at it, Skip, you look at uh, uh, Toronto, they were 10 of 37. In the first quarter, when they really blew the game open, they were like at one point like 5 of 9. And and the Lakers would just turnover after turnover. They get in layup after layup. All of a sudden, LeBron missing little bunny layups. Russ, we already know he going to miss layup. Monk missing layup. It's just, Skip, they're not winning. I, I, look at the schedule. Uh, uh, I had Steve to, uh, uh, to get the schedule, the graphic. Can we look, let's look at the schedule, Skip. Look at their remaining schedule. They're going to be favored one time. Look at the schedule. At Minnesota, we're going to talk about Cat just dropped 60, 60 and 17. Toronto just beat the brakes off of them. Yep. Washington, Cleveland, Philly, New Orleans, Dallas, Utah. Look at that schedule. They'll be favored in one game. OKC at home. Mm -hmm. How do they hold on, Skip? How do they hold on? Because right now, the what? Their game, their game in front of uh, the Pelicans, and the, the one game in front of the Pelicans, the two and a half games in front of the Blazers, the three and a half games in front of the Spurs. With that schedule on the horizon, and some of those, a couple of those are back to back. We saw what they looked like Sunday, and then they followed that up with Monday with an even worse performance. Just when you thought it couldn't get any worse, if LeBron doesn't score fifty. They don't win. And LeBron, you look at LeBron's stat line. Yeah, he had 30 and 9, but LeBron didn't play well last night. I'm here to tell you, LeBron did not play well last night. Five turnovers. He just, nah. We, if you're going uh, uh, to keep this game from getting out of hand, he might need to have a, a cat like, stat line. Like, cat got 32 in the third. LeBron needed 32 at, or 32 in, at the half to offset what was going on with the, Rap, with the Raptors. And so when, when you look at it, a team that turns the ball over like they do. So now you're taking possessions away where I'm not even getting a shot up at the basket. A team that plays defense as poorly as they do, where teams are getting, lay are getting layups. This is a layup line for teams. Or they're getting shoot-around threes. How do you win? You're not going to win. And Skip, and I, and I said this, I said, play in. They better just hope they can, you know, I don't see it. I honestly, Skip, I'm looking at this, Skip. I just don't see it. When you look at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of the 12 games are on the road. The second they got the second toughest remaining schedule outside of Chicago. Yeah. I, I Skip, I honestly, I, I don't see it. I honestly, I, I just don't see it. They're on the road for the next week. They come home for one game with Philly, then they're back on the road with New Orleans and Dallas and Utah. Okay. I don't see it, Skip. I think they're going to miss the playoffs. Mm -hmm. not, the, not, not the No, the playoffs, they're not going to be in the play-in. They're going to miss the playoffs entirely. I don't mean to put it on your nose, but it's clear. How my baby's running this the block because you fear what you do.